Hi everyone, so I'd like to share with you my design for the carburetor which I've come up with for the uh, GX25 engine which I'm going to be using as a range extender for my electric bike hopefully. So I've taken this design here and I've changed it quite a bit. So what I've done I've done to it is added might have put a whole new manifold in and I've uh, got holes there where the butterflies valves will go or rather the shaft that drives them so if we go down uh, that channel forming there is the idler channel so that's I, I believe that goes after just ahead of the main butterfly valve for the throttle come up uh, that's where the sort of shaft will go which turns the butterfly valve if we go up further uh, there's a very big sort of manifold forming there so we've got eight holes in the middle of a venturi into which the propane gas should hopefully flow And it comes up like this and, and there's the other channel where the shaft for the next butterfly valve will go and as you can see there's the holes there right in the middle of the venturi and that's it so hopefully this design will work wonders. Uh, there's some, something a bit wrong with it when you view it this way. I forgot to triangulate it, um, but it prints fine. So I've already printed off the first version of this, but uh, the channel inside was a bit too small and I only had four holes. So it, it should perform much better now that I've made these modifications to it. Um, you never know, I might even take the holes out completely and make it one big continuous slot maybe although that's, uh, that's actually impossible because it would just collapse in on itself so that should hopefully be a, a good enough design but let me know what you think because maybe there's someone out there who understands carburetor design uh, for propane gas a, a lot better than I do I could maybe give a little bit of advice.